Good evening all. Good afternoon rather. <laughs> I usually stream an evening. Hence why I forgot. How are we all doing today? On this wet and windy Sunday afternoon here in the UK. So we're going to jump into this. So the last time we managed to disable a, a strike drone, a large strike drone. So I've been repairing the ship, making a few modifications to the rear end. Also, whilst I was doing that, I was attacked by a smaller drone, which even without my guns on, didn't do any damage. So I was able to capture that one. Unfortunately, that was off stream because I was doing all the welding. Uh, but that's the way it goes. But anyway, so we've run out of iron. Uh, but luckily we're anchored to an asteroid, so we could just mine the stone, but there is an iron deposit on the asteroid. But we're going to try and salvage the ship. Um, so we'll need to make some modifications to, to that little thing we've captured. And I added this uh, red alert button. Well, I think I did this last time. I've changed it now. I don't have a red alert sign. I've got no entry sign. There's a flashing red light there. There's actually several flashing red lights throughout the ship. And what happens, that will make sure it will switch the guns on. Uh, because when we capture a wreck, we turn the guns off. Otherwise, they'll just obliterate it. Um, and these are timer blocks. So they're not related to the... They run the red alert, but they're not... The color doesn't change. Uh, so there's a, a light there, look. And there's one on the other side. And if we go into the... Hangar bay. Then there is one up there and one over the other side. So whilst I was welding, I, I found a problem. The ship was slowly just rotating and moving away from the asteroid. I tried a few things, even turning the power from back on. Unfortunately, turning the power off turned the connectors off, which meant these things bounced around. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> unfortunately. Um, but there we are. So we have that. I've changed this to the red alert button as well. So it will depressurize the entire thing. When I say depressurize, suck the air into oxygen tanks. Uh, because obviously that's our lifeline. I've also added, and we open this now, some flashing yellow lights just to show the door is moving. Uh, they don't change red, they just stay yellow. And there we are. Um, so let's have a quick tour of what I've done. Uh, so this is the wreck that you guys have already seen. Uh, I stuck that on it just so I could take ownership of it, so I can turn the gun on and everything. So I've repaired the drill. I made this uh, opening smaller. Now, unfortunately, these doors only opened are a four width grid. And the drill is five. So what I probably will do is put the doors that close that way. Put one here to close that way and one close that way. And I just leave an opening in the middle. Um, but I need to raise the drill up. As you can see, it sticks out too far. Previously, I just turned the hinge. Uh, and the drills would then sit up uh, here. But they actually sit where this block is. So we're going to need to uh, move it up. And I thought, well, I'll do that on stream. Because if I, if I make a mess of it, you guys can see. Uh, repaired all this lot here. So I built the side panel now. I was hoping not to make it so square, but the problem is the wheels of the... Anything sticking out past here we're getting out. Uh, this, these two panels are heavy armor. But the rest of these are light armor. Uh, so then on the back, we've got the six turrets. This is all heavy armor as it was before. We now have heavy armor here. It's been one guns. And 
I did a little bit of creative work with this up right here. We could possibly do something on the back, maybe, maybe continue that theme uh, along. So that you have a raised raised platform in the middle going down. Now it might be something we can do. We'd have to move these guns over one because uh, we wouldn't be able to have any blocks in that position. Uh, but we got all those. Uh, I think. Is this one? No, no, no. Oh, yeah, PDC. I call it a PDC. So this one and that one only target missiles. And they're excluded from the turrets group. So when I turn all the other weapons off, those two will stay on. That way, if anyone does attack us, at least they'll shoot the missiles. Uh, so that goes up to the top. So we've got extra guns here and we got some guns on top. Again, I could possibly continue that design uh, just to break just to break it up a little bit. And we can possibly use some half block or something. Now these uh these blocks oh, that's actually cool. Let's go. Come on. <laughs> there. Those blocks don't stick out as much. So we might better use some of those to make come some kind of pattern. Uh, but we've run out of iron. Uh, so I've obviously fixed this stuff up here. No real change. I was thinking about using heavy blocks on the back, but not that we haven't done that. Uh, this iron thruster, I want to move it back a level so it doesn't actually stick out past. I mean, I know they stick out. But they don't need to stick out, so we'll make that level. I had to remove these wind turbines in order to put these on. Anyway, but uh, wind turbines aren't needed, and we might be able to remove all of them. And that one's actually smoking. Yeah, a bit of smoke on that one. Uh, so I said I want to move the bridge to the middle because as you've seen at the beginning when I'm in the front of the ship I can't really pivot around uh, we've got this section on the side we're going to put hydrogen thrusters in here we've only got two I might continue that pattern along and have hydrogen thrusters all the way along and I can't really put those thrusters here because these things are three blocks deep you've got one block sticking out here one there but if we, you can see there, the thruster is actually up against that. So we wouldn't be able to put those there. I've left this here because I want to build a little walkway. Because um, we've got some walkways here. Need to do something with that. So I want to build a little walkway along here. Maybe make this a kind of a room. Uh, I've left these here. I'll probably put a turret top and bottom and on the side until we've got the three turrets there. So this this bit goes over here, which will probably have a walkway. I need to do something at this end. And I started doing this one and run out of iron. This is going to do it. So this is the ship we captured. That, uh, that was mine, I put on there to, to capture it. Um, as you can see, it's taken a bit of damage, but it's got a lot of ion thrusters on it. Obviously there isn't one there. <laughs> um, but there's no ion thrusters pointing in the downward direction, so we will need to rearrange that. Now I can't grind these down. Although they don't see NPC ion thrusters. Then normal ion thrusters, in theory, I should get platinum from them. And if that's the case, I can just reposition them. I don't have to do anything fancy. Um, let's try it. If it doesn't work, we can always just reload it. Do I get... I do. I get thruster components. Okay, that's good. So I, I don't have to mess around with that one. I can literally just... Put them where I want them. Uh, 
Uh, with ion thruster. Okay, that's good. I can't do that on these ones because these are NPC ion thrusters. I know that's his ion thruster as well. The NPC ones only gave me scrap. But these are actual ion, although it would be good to try and move them in place. Hydrogen thrusters, yeah, these are hydrogen thrusters, okay. This is this is a standard wreck. So what we do, we'll uh We'll turn that ship into something. And then I can cart things around there. One thing I didn't think of doing was pressurizing this place so I need to work in the warm. Uh, but then there's a risk of depressurization when I open the door. We do need to move these things. That could be something we can do. There was a private sale shadowing me. A uh, neutral target. Uh, but a reaver came in and uh, killed it. The reaver did come towards me, but it didn't engage me. That's probably because I changed the antenna to only be short distance. Only 500 meters, so we were actually out of range of the, uh, the reaver. Uh, so this thing only has little batteries, which are possibly dead anyway. That's got final watts. That's not going to be good, is it? Four battery three. Which one are you? Your battery two. Your battery three, which means your battery one. We got guns on this. It's an interesting design of ship. It's in the power on. I might turn. Most of these thrusters off. And see if I can navigate with just like one thruster in each direction. Because that battery, the reason there's three batteries on it is I put one on it. Actually, we leave that one on. And, um,. Actually, it would look better. That it doesn't actually make any difference, but we'll uh, we'll do that. Okay, these are all off. Oh no, that says on. Okay, I think we've run out of power already. <laughs> Why are we exhausted the? power when it was not doing anything I don't know yeah none of them should be an override okay I don't want to put a big batch on it until we worry about where we're gonna put it so you are dead I need some parts which I can get from here and that would draw two steel plate hopefully <laughs> it's enough yeah 
Right. So turn you off. You. 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 Hopefully now we just got one thruster in each direction. And the landing gear is obviously set to auto block. If I turn off the dampeners, it doesn't auto correct. And we have a piece. Why that? Ah, uh, then maybe the thrust had that piece attached. All we could do is open this door. And we'll go park in there. Yeah, that knows this copy. I, I stuck this copy on. I was on a good design, good location. Could just crap this entire ship actually, but uh... so as you like watching Star Citizen, we were essentially flying in decoupled mode. I think we need to get rid of that connector. Anything in it? No, nothing in it. And we should be able to catch the landing gear. And lock. There we are. And we can turn you off. Oh, wait. They actually have too many on that one side. Red marks keep popping up at the mayday signals. Oh, yeah, a devourer. All my guns are on the back. <laughs> okay. You can see the red lights flashing away. Gun drawn anyway, but uh this will be depressurizing.
Is he coming towards us? We don't have many guns at the front. But they are all on. Now, if he comes to the front, we might be in big trouble. I got, I got basically two guns there, two in the middle, two on the side. Now, I think he is crossing our path. He's 3.8 kilometers away. That's the exiled engineer. That's the dangerous signal. He wants me to go to him. But you were 3.7 kilometers away. Uh, if he'd seen us, he'd be coming in much quicker than that. He's, he's flying past. Three point six turret. We got turret front. Right, let's uh, control. You. Where are we? Here is over there. That's three point four kilometers away. See the size of that ship. Those are thrusters on the side. That's the antenna on the front. Yeah, he's going past. Look, he's gone back up to 3.49, 3.5. Oh, look, that must be, yeah, that's Earth. Yeah. He's flying away. I don't have a button. To repressurize, yeah. The reason for pressurizing is I won't consume oxygen. As you can see, we're down to one bottle. Wait. Have you got the oh, empty bottle? It's not. Is that tank empty or something? What a refill. Zero. This thing was still on as well. So we were losing hydrogen fuel. Or rather, burning hydrogen fuel. We can open the front door, back door. Uh, we're going to put some lights up there. That door, it's on the inside. We can flash until the door is opening. Look. So oxygen is a precious resource for in space. Without it, we die. That's why I don't want to vent it into the outside world. When uh, you go into battle, yeah, four point five. He's moving away. 
Uh, so that's where we started over there, look, 137 kilometers away. Uh, so this thing hides a conveyor tube, and have you seen that lies last time? Not T, no, light. Conveyor tube running the length there. And we've got our atrium here, so I've slightly redone that look. So you go straight up to this level there, and you go across to the middles, and then down. So we've got less, less things in there. I did think of having the door in the middle here, and having, rather than this go up, have this go around. So maybe that came down onto there, and you walked along over this level. Uh, that was a thought I had. I haven't done that though, obviously. Right, so we know we can actually safely dismantle this. So we'll dismantle the guns. The battery there, which you're probably dead anyway, so we'll uh, take you off. The first thing we'll do with this when we actually uh, build it is uh, park these back on the on the deck. And you know, it's because we're in space. When I grind something down, it doesn't clunk to the ground. A nice column in there. We could put bat batteries in or something, couldn't we? It's on fire, you're on fire. There's melee signals keep popping up. Alright, so... It's like a little column. We got... Yeah, we got four thrusters. Pointing down. Don't you in that way? Uh, 
I'm tempted to stick the cockpit in here. Maybe like that. What do we think? Got the batteries in. Which I can't zoom in when we're attached to something. I need those high rise. We had the turrets on the side. If we're going to charge this thing, we actually need the connector on the bottom. I'm not going to take this in the battle. Because in three, just put a turret on the back. All those side turrets have an appeal. Energy low. Big old thing. And we got there one, two, three, five. Maybe, and then I guess they got... Yeah, they got a big connector on the back. We could put a cargo container in it. I want to move you forward if we're going to do that. Uh, let's go and... Uh, get a recharge. Actually... Can I build a seat? We need interior plate. Do we have any interior plate? Yeah, we got some interior plate. Oh, it's got a battery on it, that's fine. Yeah, so I anchored us to this thing. And we still got the rag anchored to the bottom there. And under 11% hydrogen fuel. Uh, if I put a connector there, it's going to... Disconnect the landing gear. Let me just test, take that block out. No, I didn't think so. Didn't think we could attach the side. We're going to add landing gear in afterwards. I mean, the. Uh, Connector. Now we're going to grind away these. All right, so connector. There's only two blocks anyway. And it would fit perfectly there. And in fact, we could actually do it that high to keep it in in situ. Do it one higher. Uh, how big are the batteries? 
Batteries are the same too, so we have a battery there. Let's move you up one. Right, so if we put a battery in that, that gives me too wide. Okay, I'll be too wide. So I can put one there and one there. There's my two batteries. Then cargo container big port interior plate I think that's got a big port on the bottom so that could be good actually I was saying it would be nice to link that directly to that connector without having to go through the uh, the side ports because some components can't go through side ports. If I did the big connector there, a big What do we leave behind? We left a plate. Alright, so... If we did the cargo container there... So we know it has... a port on the side. Because the guns have ports on the side. So that would fit perfectly with the gun. Cockpit. Yeah, okay. I don't, I'm not liking that with the cockpit. But we can put the batteries there then. One battery there. Another one there. And then we can put the cockpit in front of it. Nice and compact little thing. Those thrusters could be moved up along there. Oh, it's battery. I thought it was right in the cockpit. We got a small one there. Got to have a small one on the side. 
Not too happy about that one being right there. We got five there. That's four. You six. I can take you and you off. You want to put a six one in there. Imagine we probably don't need that many thrusters. So I will take take you out and you. We have four four thrusters in either direction. One, two, three. We got one, two, three, four. Is that going to fall apart? No, I think to the front. I mean, it doesn't have hurt that you have. Now we'll leave the forward. Because you never know when you want to run away from Trump Frank. Good day, Laser. How you doing? We've got our red alert button, Laser. Can I show you? Are you ready for this? Ready for the hype? I'm gonna have a drink first. So, if our guns were turned off because we were salvaging something, we'd press this. Yeah, and then lights flash. <laughs> Doors close. The rest of the ship depressurizes. So that we don't vent our oxygen look we can see down the bottom there going down to low I think there we are I think oh, okay so the lights turn off before we finish vending <laughs> that's our red alert have we got a panel yeah vents maybe that's right And this door has just some yellow lights when you open or close the door. <laughs> so laser, I welded up this. I've repaired the drill. I've done the back. Now, this is heavy armor. This is light armor. There's a demarcation line there. This is all heavy armor all the way at the top I'm probably gonna extend this little pattern around here do I need to lower or raise energy low energy low yes yeah, so we have a few guns on the back How many guns have we got there? You got six at the bottom, six in the middle, <laughs> three on top, th three halfway down. But two of them are designated for PDCs, missiles only. And I was doing this side panel when I ran out of iron. Uh, 
and this is as small as I can make the hole for the drills which unfortunately is still too big for uh, the uh, the doors but I need to raise this up by one or not by one by about several which you'll do so yeah here we are this is our all our guns on the back here my shit makes the asteroid look small <laughs> Yeah, is that, I think it should be hollow anyway, the asteroid. I did think about making a base, but we are doing a nomad playthrough. So once we're once we finish with this playthrough, uh, oh there we are. There's an entrance. Once we finish with this playthrough, now we and we do another one, which could be a long way away. Uh, we'll uh, we'll do bases. We'll build bases around the place. We'll build a base on each each planet and an asteroid base, and uh, we we'll use laser antennas to link them together. So I'm thinking of extending this pattern, which will have hydrogen thrusters in all the way all the way along the front there. What do you reckon? Do you prefer the smooth transitioning into that, or would you like to see that pan all the way along? What was your thought on that? We're going to have hydrogen thrusters in these holes at the top. We've got a bit of a slope. Now we've got a bit of a Battlestar Galactica feel going on. So we have, I think this last one will be actually be a turret, not, not a... All right. The the question is, this pattern here. What do you reckon to extending it down the front? Or do we keep the smooth halfway along and then have it down the front? Now, the advantage of having it down the front is it gives us obviously more hydrogen thrusters in that direction. We could also put some in here, or we could leave that. Because that's smooth. Yeah, the question is, do we continue this pattern all the way along here? Uh, well, the ship is about, seven, I think it weighs about 7 million tons now. It was about 5.5 when we left the planet. 7.2. The chair is only there for me to sit and recharge. Um, anyway, we were in here. We were doing this ship. And these came loose when I turned the power off. We're just trying to work out a nice thing. And if we're going fast forward, we probably do want to have a good way of stopping. They don't need to be sticking out as far. I was saying that the hydrogen thrusters will stick out. Oh, it moved. We're going to have a connector there. We also need some downwards facing thrusters.
I'm positioning these in such a way that they access the cargo port that will be on this thing right there. That pattern we can obviously continue. We can continue up there. So we're going to want downward facing thrusters. Which we could put in here. So we got those thrusters pointing down. I'm going to need some pointing up as well. And we could just stick them all in a pattern like that. We also need some left and right thrusters, which we could put there. There and there, maybe. Well, that one's then going to be situated wrong. If I move that one and that one, I have you there, there. I could put that and that. That basically gives us four thrusters in uh, in either direction. Except front and back, forward and backwards. Should be, that should be good enough. We run out of steel plates, so so. Or we run out of iron, rather, not steel plates. We run out of iron. So put a little connector there. And there, we're not going to bother connecting. Him up for now. So, how have you been later? What have you been up to on this Sunday? Or is it might just be starting for you actually? Sunday, 5 pm for me. Ah, no, I, if I got the landing gear there, I can't put the connector there. Hmm. 
We could always put the landing gear on that one. Oh, can we? No, we can't put landing gear. Although we can put it. Okay, that was something I didn't want to do. But we basically just disconnected the ship. But because we're in space, it doesn't actually matter too much. Did I say a block then the landing gear? Dunno, okay, well, let's put the connector in now then. So that's all piped up. Another battery. All right, so I can't. We can put landing you on the side. Is that going to make it too difficult to dock? What if we did it on a piston? I don't think I can stick a piston. On there. Ah, oh, it still sticks out. If I stick it there. We can put landing gear there. Where we want to use the uh, okay. obviously the power is turned off. What are we going to call this ship? It's currently called Gamma. We captured it. Any ideas on ship names, Laser? My beard's got a bit grey. You can see it in daylight. I know we're going to call this one the the Laser. Alright. 
the laser battery. Uh, we'll call you battery one and battery two. Let's lay the cockpit. It's actually a script you can get to do this, but... Uh... Alright, which one's which? Not sure. These are thrusters. These are landing gear left. These are medium cargo container. These are piston left. Right, so. I'm doing this as a group, so that I can add the other one in on the other side. Is it going to want... Switch lock. Although we might come into a problem, but uh, we do reverse. Reverse, toggle block on off, and thrusters on or off. Actually, we need to do a reverse thrusters group. We don't want backwards. Actually, we can just turn the, the dampeners off, that's fine. We can't turn the dampeners off on the planet because it would drop due to gravity, but in space, we can just turn the, uh, the dampeners off. Here's the batteries. The batteries recharge on or off. And then we'll want switch lock. Right, so I turn my thrusters off, I can turn my power back on. That's the point. Turrets. These are turrets. Turn you off. That goes down a little bit too quick. We change the speeds. Soon enough, right. And we're locked. Looks like I found another easy target. Uh oh, uh oh. Is he. Is he gonna hurt us? Up tiger drone. Let's um let's control you. Looks a bit small. Tell you what, I'm going to save and go in my ship spotter. I haven't set a beacon for it.
All your bases belong to us. Did we kill it? Did we kill it as a reactor? Oh, shit. There's a timer block. Are we moving? We're moving. Uh... Inventory full. Okay, but well where's the remote control block? I don't know. Just free up some inventory space. Where is that remote control block? Inventory full. Inventory full. Inventory full. Inventory full. You keep telling me inventory full. It's still moving, are you? You're good and friendly. Got guns. Oh, there's my asteroid, right. Uh, can I make a cargo container? Interior plate. Where do I get interior plate from? You got interior plate, and you got steel plate. You got steel interior. There's interior. I know that's why I'm trying to build this. <laughs> Pick up some inventory space for me. I mean, what do I need? Inventory, inventory full. full. Need a few more. There's a few more of you. Inventory full. No, those are the ones I want. And my cargo container. Inventory full. Inventory full. There's a few more. Why can't I don't want? Scrap, go to the scrap. Come on. There, right. Now we can... Do that. Got some steel plate there. Lots of components. Okay. Uh, is that? I think that's my base over there. Access denied. Wave the parts in there. I need some displays. What's got displays? <laughs> I 
full reactor. Are we moving? We're still... We're still moving. I place ion thrusters of my own. It lies steel tubes. I saw some of those somewhere. Just one tap. You don't seem to be slowing down now. You might be moving in a different direction. Looks like I'm going to have to actually take them off. Got up, and we're going to need that way. How near the place? Right, you give me you and you. Energy low. You don't seem to be. Blowing down. In fact, we seem to be going a bit faster. Is there a remote control block on here somewhere? This some gyros. Control. There. I need a display. What has a display? <laughs> What's got a display? My ship is still moving. It's a reactor. Which way are we moving? We're moving that way. Uh, oh, I haven't placed a thruster in that direction. Okay. And there, we come to a complete stop. Yes. Right. GPS. New from current location. Glitch 2 is good. Uh, that looks like my base. Uh, I think I got one of these. Yep, yeah, charges uh charges me up. Good 
Like he was still in visual range of my base, <laughs> I'd be screwed. <laughs> we caught another vessel. Another vessel. Which we might get shot at when it brings near. Wow, we actually uh, traveled a fair distance to capture that thing. It's lucky laser pointed out that my ship makes the asteroid look small. <laughs> Let's uh, not go splat, shall we? All right, so we want, basically we want to put it. You want it. Right, there we are. Where is Glitch 2? Glitch 2 is seven and a half kilometers away. In fact, we can do new from current position. Which base? That's sort of the GPS location, not the ship marker. Which is why I had to bring the ship to a stop. Do you want worry in doing this when the uh, you can't see the thing you're flying toward. There we are. So we should be able to sit in you. Now we need a gyroscope. I think I destroyed all the gyroscopes. I think I did. That one? No, ion thrusters. War reactor. Alright. Steel plate. Okay, well steel plate's the one thing we have. <laughs> Where's my base now? We know it's seven kilometers in that direction. And we can get rid of Glitch 2. We've got one meter per second. <laughs> okay, what if we come back to a stop? Can I repair these? We actually want these ones prepared, don't we? Thrust the components. Oh. But we've got a 
Let's use one of those to repair one of those. Bit better. And we captured another ship. Woohoo! And we might want to travel more than eight meters per second. I think about keeping this one, not grinding it down. Okay, we got three thrusters to slow us down, so it shouldn't take us long to slow down. Now our base is 5.8 kilometers away. What's on here which is access denied? Antennas, Gatling guns, Laser antenna, small reactors, okay. Uh, 2.6 kilometers away. Two kilometers. 1.9, 1 1.8, 7, 6, 5, Four. Three, that'll do. It's come to a stop. One kilometer. Uh oh. Oh, I think just far enough it doesn't doesn't shoot us right. So it said antenna. We know we got reactors there. So oh. why do you back up? Low the hack line. Why do you back up? Antenna, we don't want the antennas anyway. What else was it? Another antenna, two laser antennas, two Gatling guns. The Gatling guns were there.
Okay. Um, there's a laser antenna. Uh, a laser antenna is a very long range antenna, but it can only point in one direction. So if we would establish like an asteroid base and a planetary base, that would allow us to communicate between the two of them, whereas a general antenna would be a nice sphere of signal, which a reaver would spot. Anything else now? No, nothing else denied. So let's uh, save you and hopefully we can fly towards the base without getting blown up. How long have we been on for? An hour and 40 minutes. Oh. <laughs> yeah, so we look at the laser antenna. It's human 100. We can turn them off actually. But yeah, you give it coordinates and uh, range 50 kilometers, infinite range, look. But that would take a lot of power. What do we call this one? Succubus, is it? Or Succuli? What was the one in the expanse? I can't remember now. Scopuli, I think, was it? There's our ice and iron that we need to go mine. We don't have a uh, shuttle bay big enough. <laughs> yeah. 
It was so calm and relaxing in space. Are we going to miss those wheels? We have built a monstrosity here, haven't we? So what we're going to do is take a landing gear on it. Uh, where's my nearest cargo access point? Can I withdraw a steel plate? Oh, those half blocks. Okay. You need a steel plate. Well, funny you should say that. <laughs> Where do you have? Well, we got some steel plate in there anyway. I don't actually want it to also lock. Landing gear. Oh, I actually want it in here. Landing gear. Which lock? So I'm sure you've guessed where we're going to park this. Now we are just going to park view here. Oh, you know, thrusters, all our thrusters. Are you off? On. Ah, I did the wrong one. I did switch. Oh, I want to switch lock. There we are. Now we're locked. We got another little ship to, to play around with. <laughs> we got two. This one's a lot bigger. A worthwhile uh, excursion there. Uh, right, so I'm going to do the same on this side there with the piston.
Uh, what have we got now? So that'll be laser piston R. And laser gear pistons, we both of you. And you got landing gear. Here we laser landing gear. Uh, why did it have to be like that? Two point two. You can be point two. Uh, then there are eight and also a lot and now we have the two locked and there's another battery uh, we will just put those in Mainly so we don't lose the battery for something stupid. Actually, that can be... Square blocks. Then we can have something like that. We got a little pattern there. Uh, for now. And now we'll just go with something simple. Theory. We can do that. And it should sit just off the ground, look. And the reason for doing that was so I could see where I can Blocks. I'm going to be careful with the landing gear, but we can probably. Something like that.
Seems to be right, seems to suit. You want to advantage of you having your jetpack? Probably do something around there. That <laughs> seems right. I think it doesn't look too bad. Those ones. If I'm going to want to do something like that anyway. Chubby cheeks. I think I'm gonna win any design of <laughs> uh, not anytime soon. How does that pan out? Oh, we need something like a gyro. Don't we really need an antenna? Do we need a gyro on it though? Number five. So let's stick a gyro. 
Right in the middle. Oh, we can't actually put anything there. Okay. So maybe it's better for the gyro. There. Chained that up to How do you tell how how's it going? Actually, I didn't want to change that. We've captured uh, several ships while you've been gone. This one, which uh, I basically redesigned completely, but we also just went out and captured this thing. I'm not too bad for a wet and windy Sunday. Yeah, we still got to salvage that thing. But uh, yeah, we captured this hacker drone. Um, so we got ion thrusters, which is good. Get some energy. We made some changes to the base. Uh, we got the, the atrium in the middle there. We got uh, a lot more guns on the back. <laughs> a lot more guns on the back. Yeah, I want to move the bridge halfway along so I get a better third person camera. So this is all armored up. I do want to, I create this little raised platform, which I might extend that theme out and around the back just to get rid of the kind of brick edge sort of look. And we have to move these guns over one, but all these guns are all piped up. They're all, uh, they are all piped up. I repaired the drill rig. This is about as small as a hole I can make for it. So I'm going to put some um, armored doors on it. Unfortunately, the armored doors will only come to the air there. They won't cover this middle block, but we'll uh, we'll discuss that. But currently, we've run out of armor. So I was finishing this side piece off here, and I ran out of iron, not armor, iron. So now we've got this ship. We're going to use this to uh, salvage those big ion thrusters. So when we're naming the ships, this ship is called the Laser. Um, that mean too busy to be honest. I get on with it just off stream. We need we need to come up with a name for this one. It's currently called N NPC CPC Hacker Drone. <laughs> any any ideas for names? <laughs> Now here then, I might just... It does flow right off the tongue, doesn't it?
Do I do a square? No, let's do... <laughs> carries, carries a theme. Call it day. I can't name it after me. I think we need to, I think we can't leave those stuck out of that now, can we? Flows a bit. I think it flows a little bit better than that one. <laughs> you might have to put those blocks on here then as well. If I can find, oh, I want to, I want to type. Uh, Hmm. Now, maybe just a straightforward slope. Then, if we're going to do that. There we are. <laughs> you can spend ages just trying to find the right key combination. So we're going to want a, probably a square block. To kind of do something. Sometimes they just go right in. This <laughs> shit. Got little arms on the side. We got little legs. <laughs> we probably want to extend those blocks. To provide some cover. You need to be called Rex. <laughs> um, need to redesign this crown now then. Too close. I don't think I'll win uh, any award, but <laughs> have you heard me say that earlier? <laughs> Form over function. So you can go there. Duckling. 
As in ugly. Actually, we could do those. That might get away with a little bit of... He likes Jimmy to her back. <laughs> Till wants to rename the ship Laser. He, he thinks Rex might be a bit of a better name for it. <laughs> I think they always look like a fr flying brick. <laughs> The duck thing can stand up. <laughs> I'm going to use it to tow things into place, so I don't want the landing gear too close to the uh, to the connector. So I put them on pistons. <laughs> quite look like this when I did that though. <laughs> do we need another do we need another piece there just to just to finish it off the thrusters contain all the thrusters it does we turn the thrusters on unlock the landing gear oh shit that didn't seem to go down well What is going wrong there? You're both set not to lock. But, ah, oh, right. Hmm. 
Are you? You're landing laser gear. Laser gear needs to be both of them. I thought it was both of them. All right, so if we extend, which I can't zoom in any more than this. If we unlock and retract, it flies. We do need to get a chart. We need to get these things locked as well, though. We've got five days worth of power. Oh, give me an external view that I'll try and get some kind of view on that. Wow, those pistons really don't like. There's a landing gear on that thing. Landing gear, oh, the landing gear is there, right. Might need to put some more gyros on this if we're going to use it for towing heavy objects. Okay, that thing is locked. Oh, I need to unlock you. All right, yeah, I think I definitely need more, la uh, more, um, Thingamajiggies. Gyros. Mm. Ooh. Did I just get roasted by the thruster? Alright, so we got a five. That's got one landing gear on the side. Okay. <laughs> I 
think I need the camera. <laughs> Not the problem. Oh, wrong way. Doing things in reverse is not very easy. And we're not getting a lock on that. Okay, we're hitting the... There, we got a lock. Which one? Which one? Number... Neither one. No, we're not clear of... Uh, yeah. I gotta go that way. That way in there. I wouldn't have to go a little bit forward. Intact. I could always put auto lock on it, but oh, there we are. And lock. And we can. Uh... Unlock you. There we are. Perfect. Now, if we can... I don't have the connect on here, do I? Connect it. Switch lock. There we are. And lock is five. Then the engine's off and change the batteries to recharge. I still got stuff stuff here. Right. Uh, I'm gonna just quickly shut the uh, the window. So let's just uh, turn that sound off. I'll be back in uh, two minutes.
Hello. Oh, so downstairs, the cat said, I'll wash you down here. You should feed us. Okay, so how long the charge? No, uh, 10 minutes, okay. Uh, so that thing's stuck by there, that's fine. So we're going to uh, move these thrusters. Now I could dismantle them. Um, and just rebuild them, because they're not NPC thrusters, they are just normal thrusters. We'll try the option of moving them. The one is is attached. Right, cargo container. Oh, you need to be fixed. Now that access your goodies. You can use the drill, can't you? Now I draw one steel plate. I don't want the landing gear. I want that. And probably that one. Uh, no, it was this thing. Take the ice out. Take the ammo out. And get disorientated. There's a thruster, that's why we can remove. Yeah, we can remove that one. And you, okay. Why are you floating away? Oh, it's just that, okay. Are we worried then? Missile launcher, any missiles in the launcher? No connected devices. No, you're empty. Oh, we got you. We can. Re can we repair you? Nearly. Oh, thruster components. I don't think we're going to be able to repair that one. I have to sacrifice him. You don't need this tip. And I need you. I 
car container is empty. Is it attached to anything? I've got a turret. Anything in the turret? Yep. Can we repair the turret? We need computers. Oh, we actually. Not too full. Means we can get rid of that conveyor. And we got a lot of blocks here. We can go. Like these are holding it together. Okay, I'm going to get rid of you. Stuff. All right, what have we got? Landing gear is locked under that, okay. Yeah, we'll deal with the energy in a second. Now, oh, should you be there, kitty cat? Kitty cat is lying on the laptop keyboard. <laughs> I can no longer monitor the stream. If the cat has managed to pause. Energy critical. Yes, okay. So the cat has paused the laptop I used to monitor the stream. So I just got you guys now to tell me if anything goes wrong. Are you comfortable? Or are just finding that's warm? <laughs> Alright, 
So what links what together now? Have we put he needs we he needs steel plate? I put that there. Even only half well, I can get rid of you. Like these aren't doing anything. That's held on by that, okay. Does this do anything? You don't. You don't. That connects that to there. But he's not connected onto that one, okay. Now oh, we found a reactor with some uranium. So those aren't doing anything. The reactor. Okay, let's go in there. Uh Assume our ship is recharged, which we'll have to rename at some point from laser to duckling. Fully recharged in two seconds. One second. It's always going to be that way. Right, so thrusters on. Batteries off recharge number nine connector unlock <laughs> the, connect the connect is too strong. <laughs> Damn. A magnetic pull of the connector is too strong. We want to take a blueprint of this. And the laser, yeah, I'll do. More is not available. All right. What that means. You like your little ship laser? <laughs> A little beak on the front. <laughs> we need to give it a color scheme.
Uh, that one looks a good candidate. Yeah, that's many for when I'm running away, they can shoot something. There we are, we got, we got it. Now we just have to do something with it. Oh, what happened there? Oh, should I press? Damn it. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> I press the unlock rather than... Rather than <laughs> I sick. Oh, come on, come on. Oh great, that's gonna make it even harder. A lot. Got it. <laughs> At the base. Over there. Well, the cat's managed to open a Microsoft help and learning page. Hmm. Oh shit, I'm in a row two as well. The problem with this, I can't see very well. Right, let's um Oh Tank. How will you do? Oxygen tank. We need hydrogen. We're not too bad on hydrogen. 
There we are. Right. Uh, now I want to move him back one. Be dangerous with that left there. Attach. <laughs> I'll attach you here on the edge. At least four of those because I'm going to need a few. Don't need firing. Don't turn on. Lucky the base is locked to the uh, the asteroid. Now we're going to want to move. You. Let's um, take away things that will get in the way. <laughs> okay, I'm going to need to take that one out. So we're going to want to move him back one. So I need... Get on for merge block. What's the best way of doing it now? Yeah, that might be an idea. Merge block there. And merge block there. Okay, we're locked. 
Uh, get rid of you. Oh, come ready. All right, let's go. I don't think force of that block. There we are. Is this ship actually moving or something? Having all them keys is a pain. you off. Uh, I don't know why we are... That is so strange. If we unlock one of these. Okay. Good to know. This thing is <laughs> real difficult. Right, I can take you. And you're on the back. Okay, so I can't. 
immediately put it on, but I can put you up there. Yeah. There we are. Two thrusters. Which we can repaint. Uh, so they would be just normal blocks. Hope we can get rid of these guys. Okay, so we got two there. We don't have any on the other side. This cat's getting really comfortable. Okay, now what I might do is see if I can't actually merge two of these together whilst we're on the ship and then move two at the same time. Wait, that thing is attached by hydrogen thrusters. Oh, we're gonna see how we do that. Uh, where's my thingy? Where's the leaf? <laughs> That's it, brother. <laughs> Alright, if I turn around, use my controls. They're gonna be similar. No, you didn't lock. Why didn't you lock? That's why. Although, is it locked to the wrong thing? There we are. Now we got it locked. You can't roll over there, not enough room is there. Um I think I'm gonna have to dump the stuff I got. Um well 
you. And I think you. And it's broken free. All right, so we want to put you there, and you there. Now we don't have enough parts on us. There we are. Am I locked? Which one is locked? Are you locked? You're locked. You're ready to lock. Okay. Okay, we seem to have one floating away. I guess we're going to have to deal with this one. Come on. Actually, I think if I point at that, I can do an inertia <laughs> damp into it. <laughs> I don't go. Oh, Right. What are we going to do with that one then? I'm going to put the two on the back. How many more have we got? Another one, two, three, four, five, six, plus seven all I got. Eight, nine, ten, you got eleven. We got another number. Where did I leave the ugly ducking? You probably want some. Forward. Or reverse interesters.
We've got three hydrogen there and a turret. Get a little atom there on the inside. Two bots. Nothing in here. One, two. Get rid of you. Thrasher should be okay. Uh, I did have three blocks tonight. No one. No, it's in one place. Keep forgetting the merge block takes up a block. I don't know why I keep forgetting that. This is going to go so well with that turbine. <laughs> I can just see it now. Nice turn off. <laughs> it appears to be rocking. <laughs> well, that's moving, that's the actual ship. <laughs> Is he rocking on his landing gear? Yeah, we get a bit of movement on that. And that's of a landing gear on there for the time being. Then. You're trying to make as much space as possible. There's no results found in the start menu for S W S S S S S S S S cats. My cat is about to search the internet.
Not sure if we can do anything about that rocking. stopped. All right, we got one there. <laughs> so funny. I'm going to dock this thing back in the bay and then I'm going to call it because I need to go and uh, once do some things for food and whatever and we'll be back we'll be back on in about two hours with the uh, surviving Mars Batteries on recharge. How much do we take out of the batteries? Not much at all. Yeah, you can see the yellow flashing lights. We need to put some inside. Let's dump all our stuff. and sit in our chair so well we started the salvage operation we got one thruster attached there one on the front we rebuilt that little rover so I think we're all Pretty good. So we'll be back nine o'clock, which is in just under two hours, with a casual surviving Mars stream. Hopefully, you guys can join me for that. We see who's on. Pass you on to someone. And we got Space Cutler is playing Star Citizen. We haven't made Space Cutler in a little while, so we made Space Cutler. Send some love his way, and uh, hopefully, I'll see you later on. <laughs> 